Hey, Ro. How hey. are you? Good afternoon. Good afternoon to you. All right, we have a follow up recipe. You guys saw how Hero actually filleted this beautiful fish. Mm. The halibut, flounder, fluke, whatever you want to call it. Now, Hero san, what are you going to make with this beautiful uh, meat? I'm going to fry it up for the front, uh, the bones. Okay. And I'm going to make a uh, tempura. All right. I can't wait because I am so hungry here. Mm. Okay. Let's talk about the ingredients. What do you have going with this? Uh, of course, from the fillet and the bones and the tempera powder, flour. Okay. And the, this one, I'm gonna just put on under the flounder, right? And then I have over and onions. Okay. Onion, maybe I don't need it. Maybe, maybe yes or no. Okay. That's what I'm thinking. And anyway, I wanna use a salt and pepper too. Okay, very, very good. Our hero. Yeah. What is the first step? So, first step, I need to fry the up to <laughs> this. From the head to tail. Okay. Okay. Now this is a good sized pot. There's a lot of oil in here. Yes. If you guys are frying at home, make sure that you have some so this is a quart containers with a top. You can just filter it and reuse it. Yeah. Here, I'm gonna put a little bit of cornstarch on it. It's gonna be my favorite part. I love to eat the thin zero. Yeah. Right? It's, it's like really bit, crunchy. Making a bit, bit crunchy. Oh, I love those. Especially the tail too. Mm -hmm. Once that thing's fried up, oh man. Guys, I've never tried it. Try it with some cornstarch. You'll love it. This looks like a lady. Okay, now taking out from the oil, but uh, this is a little bit of challenging. Look at this. Beautiful. Wow. Okay, ready? Okay, I'm gonna first I'm gonna put on the paper towel. Then, yeah. So tempura uh, flour, this is uh, all you know, the original, I mean regular tempura flour, butter. So I'm going to add, this one I'm going to keep uh, original, yes. And these two I'm going to change in a little bit. But this one, I actually I'm going to cut to the over and then mix into the beginning, the whole stuff. The other one might I going to slice the meat and then and then put it over then i'm gonna fry so i serve a different way i'm gonna make it today here Next one, I'm gonna try put a little bit to the matcha powder. A little 
if I diddle. Okay, this end of our stuff, I just cut into a little bit smaller. Okay, that's it. I put a little bit of salt and pepper. So now I'm going to start to Fry up the bra. So this is all over. Put some over on the top. Okay, next one, let's try the matcha. Interesting. Yeah, interesting, right? How the yeah. things are going on. Life is an experiment. Yeah. Try and keep trying. As I say here, and we said never say never, right? Never say never. Always be open to trying new things. New recipes. Oh, yeah. Okay, matcha one ready. It looks nice, huh? Yeah, green something, right? Okay, so now I'm going to make a regular one. Normal. The normal. Normal one. This is not normal. So earlier, what I've tried to say is uh, we can do a uh, kind of uh, either way, wrap with a meat or wrap with a oven. You know. But this one sometimes is broken. Open up in the, in the oil easily. So if you stay, it's okay. Okay, right, like that.
So this is the angle of parts. Okay. My favorite part. That's your favorite part? Yeah. There's no, is there bones in there or no? No, no. I'm going to make a tempera sauce. Here is a soy sauce, one cup. One, and then meeting, one. Then water, four. Okay, then just heat it up. Okay, that's it. Okay, I'm just gonna keep this one here. Okay, so now I'm gonna set up on the plate. This is uh, the beets from the beets, uh, the how they call the uh, stem or stem, something? Yes, just for decoration. Take a look at this dish. Unbelievable presentation. Hiroshan, you use the whole fish except for just a little bit of the guts. Everything else is used, but a lot of work. Three and a half pounds of a lot of work here, Hiro. What do you have to say? It's okay. <laughs> I'm hungry, that's what I have to yeah. say. And I can't wait to try it. <laughs> Well, thank you so much. Yeah. You guys like the video, give it a thumbs up, and comment below, share it. Don't forget to subscribe. Now that you see how Hiro's done it, you can try with a smaller fish, but you guys gotta try these recipes. You'll enjoy it so much. Herzan, thank you. Hey, thank you very much. Okay, Hero, we are here at the tasting part. Take a look at this beautiful fish again. What a spectacular mm. presentation. Like you said, it's a lot of fish for the plate, but if not, you know, you, know, you would put it in a separate plate. I think yeah. putting it all together just shows you. <laughs> uh, everything I put the standing, that's Yeah, right. that's true. But I think it's fine. Obviously, in a restaurant, you would never serve it like this, right? Or maybe you would. All right, here's on. Enjoy. I can't wait to try it. Okay. All right. I Especially have a the matcha one, right? Yeah, matcha one, right? Of course, I'm going to go this one. That's your favorite part. Mm. It's like uh, the top of the fin area. Mm. Go with the matcha. That's a straight to without anything. That is good. How's the matcha here? Mm. It's interesting, but the uh, matcha flavor is not much. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately. I agree. But uh, color is kind of unique, right? Yeah. So we just with the oba. Mm. Got this uh, mayo with 
Me too, me. Mm. Mm. That's good. I probably like this one the most. The one with the oba, the plain one. Mm. Which one's your favorite? I like this one. Oh, yeah. this one I haven't tried yet. Yeah. Lap, Try this one. one. Try some of this. Mm. This one, you know, after I've, uh, um, everything set up on the plate, we were taking a picture and all kind of stuff. A little bit of getting saggier, mm -hmm. you know. But this one's still crunchy in the outside, right? The yolk is really crunchy. I like this one, I like the texture. Mm. Mm. Well, a lot of work. I think all the outside is good too. Mm -hmm. mm. Mm, we gotta try some of the fish too here. Yeah, in the thing, especially this one. Take a piece of that. You can see that? Oh, yeah. Mm. That to me is, I love that part. Mm. How's it? Very good. It's like a potato chip. It's how crunchy it is. Mmm. Mmm. It's good. Very good. And just a little bit of meat on there. And you try the flavor so you know. Mm. It's fish. Hero, thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. you guys like this video and hopefully you tried it at home. And uh, we're going to try the rest of this off camera. See you guys soon. Next time. Nihon no mina san, konnichiwa. Terada Sushi Dojo no Terada desu. Eh, konkai desu ne, Nihon no subtitle wo irete desu ne, atarashi channel wo suta shimashita. Original no channel wa Dari Ari of our master sushi chef to iimasu ne. Eh, Nihon no ne, subtitle wo irete desu ne, Nihon no mina san ni tanoshin de moraita to omemashite, no channel wo hajime mashita. Dozo. Today I have a great news. Uh, Japanese subtitle version channel is start. The name is Terada Sushi Dojo. It's in the kanji. Of course, you guys cannot read it, but a new channel. It's already started. Please watch it. So every video at the beginning, I speak in Japanese, a special introduction there. So something new, something new. In the future, a lot of videos coming, also Japanese special version of the video also coming too. So please stay tuned and more subscribe. Thank you very much. See you next time.